If dogs had nine lives, Cole would have been through a few. Hit by a car in Hawaii and left to die, he is saved, his leg amputated, and through the kindness of strangers, brought to New Orleans. For months, he struggles with his other back leg, also badly damaged, and ultimately chews it off. Vets suggest euthanizing Cole. His caregivers at Dag's house, a rehabilitation facility on the West Bank, say no. His second leg was amputated, and through sheer love and will, Cole learned to walk on two legs. The people at Dag's house not only saved Cole, but other dogs that needed rehabilitation or even a wheelchair. The good news is Dag's house has expanded uptown to what was the old Methodist home, where dogs like Cole can get even more rehabilitation. <laughs> yep, that's our Cole swimming and building his muscles and feeling good about himself. You're doing a good job. Cole is not alone in swim therapy. Some dogs have orthopedic problems, others weight issues. But to Dag's house founder, Kim Dudek, the goal is all about the animal getting healthier and feeling better. It also gives the dog so much confidence. I mean, you can see them when they get out, they're like smiling. The Uptown Dag's House Rehab Center is an entire wing of a 29,000 square foot building, which for half a century housed neglected children. Today, it is Bella Doggy, a resort spa for dogs and a 10-year dream of Kim Dudek. The second floor offers three different types of boarding, private runs, multi-dog kennels. So this is small dog kennel. And there are private suites. We purposely um, put this, the platforms in so they could look out the windows. But it is the Dag's House Rehab Wing that is the heart of Bella Doggy. Thank you. Shotzi is rehabbing from her ACL surgery, working her legs in the underwater treadmill. Dane is in another therapy room, being measured for his physical assessment. He was from Gulfport. When he was hit by the car, his family uh, couldn't afford the vet bill, and they said to put him down. But Doberman rescuer Susan Cass saved him. Now he'll start his rehab to increase his muscle mass. These dogs don't care about anyone's limitations. It's really all about enjoying life, like Cole. He has brought so much to all of our lives. Sometimes when you're having a bad day and you just you see Cole and you're like, okay, what, what, is, what is so bad in my life? That's the message this little guy sends us all. It's not what you don't have, it's finding the joy in what you do.